Hey guys and welcome to What's Up Dude. Hello everyone. Hi guys and uh, welcome back to this new episode of What's Up Dude. So today, as you saw in the title, we're going to talk about the apology language. Um, and actually, this episode was inspired by the after hour and app. After our happy hour podcast, so we're going to link their episode in the description of our episode. And um, I don't know, Leslie, what about you? Did you know about the apology language? Um, because I was not, and um, I was only familiar with the love language one. And actually, we have an episode on it, so. Nope. <laughs> that was funny, sorry. Um, no, um, so no, I didn't know the apologize uh, languages because it's not very common. Uh, love languages, yeah, we did it um, the first season, so I knew it, but apologize. Yeah, that's languages, kind of weird. Sorry, no. Yeah, that's weird, yeah. But in it's kind of normal because everyone does not the same thing when they apologize. Yeah. So, yeah. And I think it is also great to know what is your apolog apology? Apol yeah, apology language to get better at communication with other humans. Yeah, humans. sure. So, um, in order to make this episode, we also took the test. It's going to be linked in the description. And just like the love language episodes, we're going to discuss about our results. And um, here yeah. we go. You can do the test too. Oh, the people. And then yeah. you can also tell us what is your apology language yeah. on our socials. So we have an IG at WhatsAppJudePod. And uh, please let us know what is your apology language. So let's go, Leslie. What is, what are, sorry, your results? So the first one is genuinely repent. Um, it's 40%, which means that for me, if you're verbalizing your desire to change or you want to, you know, modify your behavior for yeah. the future, it's probably the best way to apologize. Apology, apologize. Apologize. Okay. To apologize. apologize. Okay. Yeah. Um, I don't know because okay, you did mistake, but if you don't want to change, it's yeah. going to go on and on. Yeah, and so you have to realize that you have to change something to do to not do the same thing. So yeah, if you and especially because sometimes you know people think, oh yeah, I'm gonna change, but just in their mind, and I'm like, I can't read in your mind. So if you tell me you're going to change, thank you, but just don't tell me, do it. So the second one is accept responsibility, uh, 30%, which means like you admit that you are wrong, like you are vulnerable. Yeah. You're, you're, yeah, you admit that you are wrong and you're not perfect and that's okay. Um, no, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm kidding. 20 person is expressing regret so understand yeah understanding you wouldn't do the same if you were back to the situation yeah i have five person which is make restitution like oh, maybe, trying to get yeah. back to what it was before uh, this maybe mistake. like what can i do to repair what i done okay what i what you've yeah. done yeah yeah okay and i have zero person okay <laughs> uh of request forgiveness because i don't like it you know can you forgive me i don't know man that's my feeling i can't tell you yes or no right now it's in you uh, know people like please even if it's not now forgive me ew man it's <laughs> i mean <laughs> i don't know you know it's like please love me Ew, I don't know, you know, you love people for who they are and I forgive people for what they've done or not. I hate when people ask me that, like, please forgive me. You want to change. Yeah, yeah, act like someone you want to be and maybe I will forgive you. And if I don't like you as you are, well, that's my problem, you know, that's it. You know, I, I hate when people ask me, forgive me. Like, <laughs> no. It's been stuff right now. Yeah, you don't ask me to pay you something. You ask me to control my feelings and I can. What about so, you? What about me? So my results actually are pretty close. So the first, my first um, apology language is expression of regret at 29%, um, which is understood as a 
sincere commitment of repair so yeah saying that you you are like you regret what you've done then i have 24 percent of accept res responsibility so admitting that i that i am wrong and then also 24 percent of genuinely repent so just like leslie said is verbalizing your desire to change i have 14 percent of making restitution <laughs> which is actually not, you know, <laughs> a big. And then I have 10% of request forgiveness. I'm not going to lie. I thought my, my result will be different because I thought that accept responsibility would be the first one because usually when I make mistakes, I know. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to handle that. I'm the one who is wrong. So, you know. But um, it is not that it is expressing regret. But I, I think it is pretty accurate because first I say to the person that I regret and then I accept their responsibility and then I genuinely repent, you know? Mm -hmm. I feel like it is pretty logical. Just like I was saying, I think this topic is really interesting because I feel like in our world and also our generation, we don't really talk as much. So sometimes we are creating conflicts or misunderstanding because we don't know how the other person in front of us is working in a way. Not to say that we are robots, you know, but um, I think it is really great to have those quizzes. And I honestly, I love taking quizzes. So <laughs> if they were, uh, quizzes for everything, especially for like uh, communication, psycho psychological things. That would be really great to to take them. What do you think, Leslie? I think um, it's really interesting. I don't know if it's like controlled by very like people, like scientist people. Yeah. Oh, if this, this is a yeah, scientific yeah. thing. Yeah, but uh, yeah, I think it's always good. Uh, maybe not for other, but for you, just to understand, like, who you are and how you act. But I think it's so complicated. Like, human beings are so different. Like, you can't have the same person twice. So you have to adapt to to the person who you're talking to. Because, yeah, no one is the same. So obviously, like, for example... No one is going to have the same result on this quiz, like the same specific yeah. number. It's it's impossible. No one. And so, yeah, I think it's really interesting because especially behavior, human being behavior, I, f I feel so much interesting because you you say something, but you don't act, talk. It's weird. I don't know how to say, to say that, but you are not aligned with your words. Okay, that's it. And so sometimes it's it's also cool, as you said, because you didn't expect this result. Not at all. Yeah, but here are there and you learn about yourself. And that's the one of the ways you can um, grow. Also, I think even if even it is even if whoa, <laughs> even if it is uh, great for other people to like know your results, the best person we need to know these results are you and the better you know yourself the better people are going to i don't know understand you is it I don't yeah know yeah right. because and also i i feel like in this society we don't really talk about feelings right because you are vulnerable you are kind of weak when you speak about it and so i think it's you you we shouldn't be like that like i mean for example talking about apologize a, what apologize language could be a good way like for example when you want to know someone alex we know each other since a few years now four years something like that oh, that's super long yeah i know um and i didn't know that about you Me you know either. and so it's also a way to discover people even if it's not like, maybe it's not a scientist thing, but you can still uh, have oh, a scientifically pretty... Scientifically proved. Scientifically proved, thank you. But you can have a pretty much good idea of what, how they work 
it's not the good word but yeah it's also a good way to learn about people who you are surrounded by and yourself and sometimes when i do this test i quizzes tests yeah i want to send them to my friends and i'm like oh that would be so great to like have not a chart but um kind of you know like a little paper with every uh, like everyone's name yeah. and you're like okay so i cannot do that with her because um she's gonna react in a bad yeah. way but that's kind of weird so so just now you know alex take it in, yeah just, don't request me to forgive you i'm not gonna do that because i don't <laughs> like people who who do that who yeah does that? who does that too yeah me? that's the same for you this uh 10 yeah, percent like please forgive me like do you have an um like i think when you ask that it's that? just for yourself it's like um yeah it's like oh you forgive me right okay i'm happy okay bye yeah i mean no <laughs> that's uh, weird it's it's not about you it's about the person you hurt yeah i think it, it's really weird it's like please love me Ew. i can control <laughs> this is i, I forgive you like or not yeah <laughs> because you know sometimes you want to forgive someone but you just can't yeah and it's feelings you you can't control i mean you can but in a way like, you can we're like... not product right you yeah you can't build build yourself and manage your feelings and do so, you yeah. have any experiences with them um, these types of apology languages because i don't <laughs> uh right now no, not right now, but um, have you experienced some... No, I know, but like right now, I'm, I'm thinking and... Take your time. The break. I don't really... <laughs> Advertising. Um... <laughs> Plot twist, we don't have any sponsor, <laughs> so we cannot put uh, advertising here. Yeah, um, but... Advertisement, um, sorry. To be honest, I have... I don't have like a specific experience about apologize. Really, I hate when people say, I'm sorry, and then do the same mistake again. That would be me. No. <laughs> I hate that. Really, like you did a mistake. I told you and you how do... to fix it. Yeah. Uh, and, and I told you how I felt about it. And you do the same again. Are you dumb or? <laughs> I mean, I, have, I, <laughs> I hate it in any ways. I hate when people are not aligned with their words. You know, oh. for example, they're like, uh, I don't know. Oh, uh, I'm a really honest person. But then they, told, they don't tell you what they think about you or they tell you, but to someone else. I mean, I'm here. You can talk to Who me. Who does that? No, but it's just... A like stupid a example. Change. Yeah, okay. Yeah, global but example. yeah, especially when you hurt me, you, if I told you and you tell me, okay, I'm going to change. Well, change, man, because I I don't want to be hurt during my entire entire life. So, see, I cannot really speak about apology language, um, just like you're doing, because people didn't have to apologize to me. Yeah, uh, yeah. I, I, like I have an experience say thing where people needed to really apologize to me. That's freaking weird. <laughs> do you remember that is an off topic, but do you remember when when in an episode I was like, Yeah, I cannot remember uh my life before I don't know, fourteen or that's super weird because I'm trying to remember and I don't have any example. Really? And that's yeah. Like I do remember some some important moments. Yeah. But not everything. I feel like I've been drugged. <laughs> I mean it's normal. You have almost you are twenty. You can't remember twenty years like of your entire life. Thanks God. You can imagine your brain. Ooh. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> um yeah, I don't have a specific experience to be honest. Because if you heard me and you don't change, get out of my life. I mean, That's for real. Harsh. Really. And if people are like, please forgive me. <laughs> Explain that 
I can't. I think I'm just going I mean, to ghost that person, like not yeah. going to answer or. Please forgive me. I I hate that. Like it's just for you. You did the mistake, and you want to that I forgive you. I don't know. I mean, <laughs> doesn't make sense. Yeah. Yeah, because I feel like my results. Oh, obviously everyone's going to have a different opinion, but yeah. I think my results are the way you should um, apologize to a person. Yeah. Because. But yeah, yeah, it's not necessarily uh, like step by step result. It's more like what's the most important when people think for you, uh, yeah, yeah, apologize to you. So I mean, please, yeah. if you want to apologize to me, <laughs> express regret. Like make a scene. Like I'm really, <laughs> I'm sorry for yeah. doing this. A whole but speech. With it, like make a scene, but a sincere scene, not you know request forgiveness. Like. You need to be in touch with your emotions and then maybe I will forgive you. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> maybe, like, I'm not very sure. Yeah. It depends of, you know, it depends of, the, yeah, of what sure. you've done wrong. Yeah. So, yeah, that, that, that was everything that I had to say for this. Yeah, me too, language. actually, because I've never been through such an experience like that. So, I can't really share something or just, yeah, I can't was, remember. But I was really happy to do that because I haven't really listened to multiple podcasts doing that, except the after hour happy hour. I'm having trouble to pronounce this name, but that's okay. And I was like, whoa, you guys are the first one to do that. Like actually in my, in the podcast that I listened to. So yeah. Thank you girls for inspiring this episode, even if you're not going to listen to this episode. <laughs> I don't know why I'm acting like <laughs> yeah. so many people are listening. Yeah, superstar, when it man. Is not the case. It is superstar. Not the case. It's all about the attitude, yeah. the positive <laughs> attitude, you know. Anyway, you know, fake it until you make it. <laughs> yes, but not in every situation. No, though. no, absolutely not. <laughs> so do you so, want to do the outro, Leslie? Yeah, sure. Okay. <clears throat> Let me do the Alex thing. Okay, guys, so you can follow us on our IG, uh, What's Up Dude Pod, uh, pretty visual things. Um, you can follow us on YouTube because we upload our episodes on YouTube now. And every platform like Spotify, Apple Podcasts, all the thing. Um, if you want to share something, like just an experience, if you want to share your results, you can do uh, on our IG uh, by direct messages or on in the, the comments. Yeah, yeah, in the comment section. So yeah, uh, you we will be so happy to discuss with you. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Did I miss Wait. anything? No, no. Subscribe. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, subscribe, subscribe to the podcast, <laughs> the YouTube channel. And follow us on IG. And I'm very sorry for this episode, uh, like the yeah the episode audio. Yeah. Because we're having like I'm having trouble with the mic today, so sorry for that. So yeah, have a good day and see you soon for another episode. Bye bye. Bye.